Hey everyone, it's Karen from Mayfly Life, and today I'm making soap! Yay! Haven't done that for a while, at least not since December 28th was my last uh, one of 2017. So this is my first soap in this year, and it is, because I'm getting excited about spring, I am making a soap that is springy, fresh, uh, and just fun. Uh, it's it's going to be a plain soap. Uh, reason being is I wanted a soap that was going to be really hard and provide lots of bubbles. And in here I have um, in here I have my uh, my oils, and I've got my lye water cooling and uh, right now but uh, in here I have uh, uh, palm, olive, coconut oil, castor oil, shea butter. So to my oils I'm going to be adding uh, some kale and clay that I've already mixed with uh, oil uh, from, my, from this batch here uh, of oils and it's right now it's a tablespoon but I'm gonna I think I'm gonna be adding more um, to it um, because I want I want this to be filled with clay so basically what I'm doing right now is uh, I'm just adding the clay uh, the kaolin clay to the oils already and I'm just gonna mix it up a bit and I want to get a little bit more clay in there. I'm going to add another tablespoon just so that it is mixed in well. I guess it would help if I got this out of here. my my lie so I'm just gonna add it in there and this is gonna probably set up pretty quickly because uh, of all the hard oils and that in here but I'll bring it to just a light trace oh it feels so good to soap again okay see there's loads of bubbles in here so I'll just stir it out a bit and get that stirred down. Okay there we go. And pull this off because I want to add my colors. And what it is it's going to be um, a blue greenish blue teal type. So I'm going to see if I can get a mix in there so it's a little bit of a tealy color mix a little bit of blue a little bit of teeny 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 bit of green and see what I get if I have to add titanium dioxide then I add titanium dioxide so let's give this a little mix yeah, I think it needs just a teeny tad of titanium dioxide. Not much, but just enough to lighten it up a bit. fragrance. 
Okay, so I add a little bit more uh, blue uh, because it was it was just a little bit too green for my liking. So uh, this is much better. And this is the color that I I really like this. Okay, Let's stir out the bubbles. I can see some bubbles coming up to the top. Oh, this smells so nice. And give it a good mix so that I'm distributing all that, fr that fragrance oil. So, yeah. And that's a good thing. You, you need to um, actually uh, stir it out a bit because you want to bring all those bubbles up so that they don't sit in the final product you don't see them and you're stirring them out so now i'm going to bring over my my mold and pour this baby in Empty it all out. And I'm just going to do a plain, plain mica top um, because uh, I just, like I said, this is more for a, a spring sort of like, eh, I wouldn't call it a spa. I'm just, I'm saying it's more spring. But, uh, so I need a, a flat top. as much of the soap as I can. That means less cleaning. Which is always better. Okay. Give this a bit of a wipe. So I'm bringing up bubbles, and I want to do just a simple top, but uh, I'm going to do a, a mica top and uh, just do some simple swirls. I've got a little bit of uh, blue mica mixed with a little bit of green just dollop some of this on just to have a slight bit of color. Okay, so Okay, so there we go. I'll show you after the cut.